Aloha Ohana. Greetings family, this is your brother Juliano. I just wanted to hop on here real quick and share a story and share some wisdom and share some insight that I know is going to be valuable to those of you that feel inspired and drawn to this video. A few days ago I posted on Instagram about what to do, what I suggest based on my personal experiences when we are finding ourselves in the midst of energies that are wanting to hook our attention and bring us out of our center. So interestingly, an experience unfolded over the last couple of days where there was my, I won't go into details about who they are, but somebody here in the property where I'm renting who was not getting her way, was in the wrong, and was starting to escalate and begin to get more and more violent. And I started to think, oh, this is exactly like what I posted about the other day. So I felt the temptation to engage in that lower vibration and to begin to yell and to argue and to justify why I was right. Realizing that this would only feed the energy and this is exactly what was being wanted of me to come out of my center to lower vi my vibration and to engage and feed that energy. So it got to the point where this person realized they were not going to get what they wanted from me and I stood firm in my truth and my I am presence. And this is the first time this has ever happened in my life. I was called an illegal immigrant. So this was like the last attempt to gain my uh, attention. And I let it slide. I let it go. But, you know, this really touched me deeply because my father is one of 11 kids that grew up in Brazil and was working when he wasn't in school and put himself through college he's a doctor he's a physician so if you ever find yourself in a situation similar but a similar energy that you recognize from this message from me sharing my experience with you I invite you to remember who you are to stay anchored in your neutrality to stay anchored in your awareness to stay anchored in your aloha in your loving frequency stay anchored in your heart because if you do not feed it, this energy, eventually it will sizzle out. Know that your beings and your guides, God, spirit, whatever you want to call it, is looking out for you. During these times, during this global unfolding, there's so much drama. There's so much pilakia. Be very mindful how you navigate through these spaces. Be very mindful where you're walking who you're choosing to relate with, what media you're choosing to engage with, what spaces energetically you're bringing yourself. Because one of the most valuable things that you can do in this time is to really care for your energy, guard your energy, be mindful, walk with two eyes open, three eyes open actually. <laughs> so I wish you all a blessed day. Um, thank you for choosing to receive this message. May this experience be medicine for you as well. Aloha.